Daytime baseball here on MLB Network. We've got baseball on the 4th of July between the Houston Astros and the Washington Nationals. And here's the left-handed hitting Michael Brantley. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. Hard hit to the left side, but taken in out there at short. Well done there, and the leadoff man is retired to start the afternoon. And that'll bring up Alex Bregman. He went hitless last night in a game where his guys could push across only one score. Back up the middle. Kendrick's got it. And the throw is wide as it pulls the first baseman off the bag. So up to the plate next will be Jose Altuve. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Now the 2 1. And you can tell he wanted to hold off, but he swings through the inside pitch anyway, and he becomes out number two. The left fielder, number four. Now to the plate, Jordan Alvarez. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. 1-1 one, one pitch and a good sinker there, but he can't find the zone 2-1. Three balls and a strike to Houston's left fielder. Yuli Guriel would be next. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. So it's first and second with two men gone. And digging into bat next, the Cuban import Yuli Guriel. Ready with the 2 1. Hit sharply toward the right side. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Digging in, Trey Turner. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Three and one to the national shortstop. Three one. And he takes ball four. So the leadoff man is on here in the home half of the first in a scoreless ball game. In now is Adam Eaton. It was a three-hit effort from him last night, so he was a big part of that victory. And he's back in standing. The 1-1 is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. Threw that fastball right by him. He had no chance to get the barrel of that one. Swing and a liner. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. In now, Howie Kendrick. Line to the right side. And that's in there. Base hit. And they're content to play station to station here as the bases are loaded now with still nobody out. At the plate, one Soto. Oh, and he struck him out. A big strike out there with the bases loaded, and that's the first out of the inning. The right fielder, Into the corner and slicing foul. Once again, a 3 2. A swing and a high drive to right center field. Brantley going back. Gone! It's a grand slam! Standing in now, Kurt Suzuki. Looked like he tried to pull it there, but he swings right through the fastball. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get good wood on it. It's going to have to lower his sights. And even 2-2 count to the Nationals catcher. And he fouls this one off. No offer on that one, and Verlander's run at full now. Three and two. 
Waiting on deck is Drupal Cabrera. And he looks at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a wall. Here now is his Drupal Cabrera. It was a two-hit effort for him, including a home run in last night's game. Is put in play to the right side of the infield. There's one. The turn throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two, and it gets him out of the inning. George Springer the next to hit, and they've got some work to do early on. Down 4 nothing already. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Hit hard to short, and the Astros have their first hit of the contest. Into the box now, Carlos Correa lifted out towards straightaway center field. After it is eaten, he gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. Into the box now, Garrett Stubbs. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. Throw over to the bag, and he'll get dirty, but he's back in safely. Set. Here comes the 1 1. Line drive base hit into the left center field gap. Into the box, Justin Verlander. Got it back in time there, and it's 2 and 1. And this ball is going to get fouled. So if you're Dusty Baker now, do you leave the bunt sign on? Here now the 2-2. This one's down to third. Great effort on the dive, but it's through into left. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet. But the bases are loaded with one away. Michael Bradley. Stepping in now, Michael Brantley. Full count still. The next 3 2. A line shot to third base. Stepping into the box, Alex Bregman. He comes in 0 for 1 on the day thus far after reaching on an error his first time up. No contact there, and it's one and two. Hey, this is a huge pitch right here. It would be demoralizing to watch this in slip away. But there to take it is Cabrera, and with that, the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll bring up the power-hitting first baseman, Ryan Zimmerman. The 2-1 home. Waves and misses for strike number two. Looped over toward first. And he'll step on first himself for the out. In now, Eric Fetty. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Outside with the fastball as the count moves to two and one now. He might still be thrown off from that first inning, guys. He got knocked around pretty good, and that can be hard to recover from mentally sometimes. There to play it is Springer, and that's out number two. Ready for another chance? Trey Turner, second trip to the plate for him. He drew a leadoff walk in the home first. Hey, going back to his first at bat, that was a terrific at bat. Saw a lot of pitches, and one of the things you want to do is try to drive that pitch count up early on the starting pitcher. Hey, I got to really commend this pitcher right here. Was able to regroup in between innings. Something happened in the dugout because he's on point coming out for the second. Throw into second. 
the tag and they'll get him at second and with that the side is retired. So now to the plate Jose Altuve two balls and a strike to Jose Altuve hasn't seen a heater yet in this at bat one might be coming right here. Now a curveball here, nowhere close. That's in the dirt. It's three and one. Pitch on the way. Called a strike, and it's full three and two. Great job by the pitcher right there, changing eye levels. We all know he's a sinker ball pitcher, but if he could throw some four seamers up in the zone like that, it could work for him. And he'll have himself a leadoff single as this is through into left. The left fielder, number 44. Jordan. At the plate now, Jordan Alvarez hit sharply on the ground to the left, and that's through for a hit. The first base, number 10, Yuliyevsky Guriel. In now, Yuli Guriel. Back up the middle. Kendrick on to first, and here indeed is a super double play. Here's George Springer. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Hit on the ground out to short. Turner loves it. Throw in time, and the side is retired. of the inning now and coming forward the veteran outfielder Adam Eaton the 2 1 takes a pass and misses that strike two he stays alive still two and two it's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Here's Howie Kendrick. He singled and scored in his first appearance in this one. Howie. The 2 1 home. Juan Soto will be next. The 3 and 1 pitch. And this is pop foul, but perhaps playable behind first, but this will land untouched. Now the three and two pitch. Now a slider here, but this will miss off the plate away, and it's ball four. So a runner at first with one man gone, and that'll bring up the dynamic bat of Juan Soto. The one-one home. Can't say he's tickling around the zone. Those last two pitches were pretty much grooved right down the middle, but it didn't bite him. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there, two away. The right field, Standing right in, off. Eric Thames. Eric. He went deep for a grand slam in his first at bat. Hey, the difference in this one, they lead by four. Go back to this guy's previous AB, a towering grand slam that knocked in four runs. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Striding in once again, Carlos Correa. He flew out in his last at bat. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. Line towards center field. That gets down. He's got himself a base hit. The throw into second. And he'll get in there safely. Now better. Standing in now. Garrett Stubbs. Liner towards second. But Kendrick is there to pull it in. And there's your first out. Now to the plate now is the back. Astros pitcher, okay. Justin Verlander. One for one Ooh. after a single this first time up. Yeah, he showed like a little prowess with the bat right there, Dan. I'd be surprised if they don't attack him a little bit more carefully this A.B. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And they won't risk it at third, so they're at the corners now with only one away. Now back. Right here. Michael Brantley. 
Into the box now. Michael Brantley. All even now, two and two. No runs, seven hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. And he holds off on the breaking ball, so the count runs full. Alex Bregman is on deck. On a line to shortstop. And that'll bring up the former first rounder, Alex Bregman. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. The 1 1 is strike two swinging. Still one and two as he fouls it away. From the belt, the pitch. Ball two. Now this guy's a grinder. Fouls off good pitches and doesn't seem to swing at the ones just off the corner. This guy's a pitcher's nightmare. Swing and a liner. And that's through into left field for a base hit. And they'll get back a run here as they're on the board. It's four to one. Now batting. The second baseman, Jose. To the plate now, Jose Altuve. In the dirt here. Good work there to prevent any advance. It's one and two. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Strike three on a pitch in the dirt. The throw to first is in time, and the inning is over. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And that'll bring in the catcher, Kurt Suzuki. One of the keys to securing a win. They want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Now here's a comebacker back to the mound. And he'll flip on to first to record the out. The Digging in the switch hitter team. as Dribble Cabrera. Out He's Drupal. 0 for 1 thus far. Cabrera. The 1-1. One, one. As anticipated, here's a ground ball now to the right side. And he'll step on first himself for the out. Striding in now for the Nats, Ryan Zimmerman. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Now the three and two pitch. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. And indeed it will. He throws him out at first and the side is retired. Hunter Strickland, a right-handed reliever standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Jorgan Alvarez. Last time through was a base hit. Now the 2-1. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. So a full count now. Three balls, two strikes, count is full. Now the payoff pitch home. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Gone to lead off the inning. At the plate, Yuli Gurriel. Ball. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Two, ball, two. Looks strikes. like that bomb earlier in the inning kind of put this pitcher on the defensive. That being very aggressive right now. Two two pitches fouled away. And now pitch on the way. And oh. here's a slider. Ooh. Strike three called. And that'll be the first out of the inning. Stepping in, George Springer. He was a ground out victim last time up. The 2 1. Hit the other way out toward right field. Right fielder is on the run. He gets there, and that's the second out. So two are gone for the Astros in the fifth. And ambling over to the batter's box is Carlos Correa. Set. Here's the 3 1. High in the air out to center field. Eaton is under it. And the inning is over.
Starlin Castro will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Hitting for Washington. Number 14. Starlin. And he took something off of it there. It's one and two. Count is even at two and two to Starlin Castro. High in the air out towards shallow right. And the move to the pinch hitter will not pan out as that's taken in for the first out. Ready no once again, Trey Turner. He was thrown out at second trying to stretch a base hit into a double in his last at bat. Yeah, Matty, his wheels got him in trouble a little bit last time. Tried to take advantage, thought the defense was napping a little bit. In retrospect, maybe he should have just shut it down and steal second base. Three and one. Adam Eaton is on deck. He'll hit next. Out in front of a fastball as this is ripped down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball. And he's in there easily at second with a one out double. So now to the plate, Adam Eaton. Oh, and Verlander loses the handle here. This one's straight to the backstop. Oh, and the pitch is low, and it won't be dug out, so he's going to take third on the stolen base. Now the 2-1 pitch. 4-2 our score here as we play inning number five. Pulled toward right center field. Brantley is under it. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he's going to get in there at the plate to make it a 5-2 lead now. Now at the plate, Howie Kendrick. Bases empty and two gone following the sacrifice fly. A ball and two strikes now. Down the first baseline. Guriel scoops it up and he'll step on the bag himself and the inning is over. Rowena Salias will come on now to make his 30th appearance of the year so far. Leading off the inning, Garrett Stubbs and they'll need him to get something going here. The 2-1 home. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. Zimmerman has it. And he'll step on first himself for the out. Josh Reddick will move into the on-deck circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. 5-2 is our score here in inning number six. And this one's low here, so the count swells to 3-1. I don't blame him for not coming over the heart of the plate. He circled this guy on the lineup card when he got to the yard today. He's been swinging one of the hotter bats in the game. And this is going to find some real estate out there as he comes through off the bench with extra bases. At the plate now, Michael Brantley swinging a ball yanked down the right field line. Now this will rattle up against the wall. In at second safely as a run also comes in to score, making it a two-run ball game. Alex Bregman. Into the box, Alex Bregman. Brentley, the runner at second with one away. comes into third now so they're at the corners here with only one out the batter, the second base Jose stepping in Altuve. now Jose Altuve one and two now as that one's fouled off runners are at the corners with one man out now a curveball misses inside 
Hey, this is a real pesky hitter right here. As a pitcher, you really like to keep this guy off the bases. This is a guy that kind of sets the tables for big innings. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Now a big swing, and this ball is rushed out to deep center field. Into the second deck and gone. Austin Voss takes the mound as he's been called upon to pitch. Number 50. Into the box now, Jordan Alvarez. And now a curveball that's low and in the dirt for a ball. It's two and one. A swing and a blast to center field. No doubt about this one. Back to back home runs as that one's way out of here. Standing in now, Yuli Guriel. Hit sharply on the ground. Turner has it. And that's the second out. Settling in now, George Springer. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. On his way to second is Springer. And he'll coast into second here with a two out double. And it looks like they'd rather go after the next guy as the intentional walk signal comes here with two away. So striding in, Garrett Stubbs. We'll see if he can come through in a clutch spot here. Two on, two out here in inning number six. A two and two count to the Astros catcher. Two men are on with two men out. Hold high in the air out to right field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Ramber Valdez enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 59. Bottom of the sixth inning now, and digging in is the outfielder, Juan Soto. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Fouled off. The one-two. This is drilled, but right into the shift. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Digging in, Eric Thames. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Swung on, but it's pulled foul wide of third. Valdez has tossed over 30 innings so far this season and has a rather inflated ERA, one that won't come down easily. A great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one, and he's down on strikes for the second out. The 2 1 home is looked at for ball three. And this pitch misses for ball four. So that's going to move a runner into scoring position now with two away. Brad Peacock takes the mound now, and it appears he's being brought in to face the right-handed batter who waits next. Yeah, you usually don't hear the term righty specialist very often, but that's kind of how they're using him here, Matt. Most hitters have a harder time against pitchers of the same handedness, so we'll see if this move pans out. Count remains full. Five runs, five hits, one error thus far for the Nationals. A swing and a ground ball to third. And a bit of a high throw that time, but not much problem over there at first as that will end the inning.
Ryan Harper will come on now and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Wilmer Defoe is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Speed pitch gets the outside. It's a cold strike. Diaz, a Cuban born ball player, he's a five year vet at the major league level. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Is swung on and driven out to right center field. A ball that's well hit, but it bangs off the out of town scoreboard. And he is in the second base with a leadoff double. Now batting, right fielder, Michael Brantley. In now, Michael Brantley. Chopper foul. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Down the third baseline. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Working for the punch out and the offering. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. back up the box and it'll get through into center field a base hit now a long throw home oh but it's offline so the run will score the third baseman number two Alex Bledman. so now to the plate Alex Bregman and here's a fastball not close as he runs it to two and one now A swing and a miss there, two and two. It's not easy to get your barrel to a pitch that high. That can be an effective location as long as he keeps it above the letters. Oh, this ball is hammered to deep center field. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Tanner Rainey comes on now, and he'll take over with nobody out in inning number seven. To the plate now, Jose Altuve. That one doesn't even sniff the zone, missing very high. Now a pitch swung on and hit to the left side, but this is going to find the seats a foul ball. Three runs already home here. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that'll get down out there near the wall. And he is in the second base with a double. His third hit this afternoon. The left number 24, Jordan Alvarez. Into the box, Jordan Alvarez. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Classic case of the front shoulder flying open on that off speed. Needs to stay compact and stay in the big part of the field. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Here's one that misses inside, and the counts run full now. Three and two. The payoff pitch home. This is on the ground over to first. And it's a productive first out as that runner is able to advance 90 feet up to third here. Now the Cuban import, Yuli Guriel. Three runs already home and a potential fourth standing at third base. The 1 1 home. Ball. 2 1. A 
man at third with one away. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. Into the box, George Springer. He's doubled and singled in four at-bats in this contest. Fastball is looked at for strike two. One of the most frustrating things for me to watch in this game is guys getting count leverage. And threw it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends the inning. Rogelio Armenteros gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Number 61. And here now is Wilmer Defoe. He's newly entered into the ballgame, so this will be his first trip to the plate here in inning number seven. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle. And this ball is crushed deep down the right field line. And that is off the wall, but in foul territory. Foul ball. There's a ball low. He misses with a changeup. Two balls. Two strikes. This is swung on and hit to Altuve at second. And that's the first down. The speedy no matter, Trey Turner seven. digs in now. Trey Turner. Here now the 2-2. Sent on the ground out to second. And that is through into right field for a single. Into the box now. Adam Eaton. On the ground up the middle. He's got it. Altuve for one. Over to Guriel for an inning ending double play. Daniel Hudson has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 44. Daniel. New inning set to get underway, and next will be the imposing power bat, Carlos Correa. Donnie oh, couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane of the plate, and that'll be ruled a strike. Where this one almost in books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Well, Matty V, I don't know what your thoughts are, D-Roll, but boy, when the weather starts to warm up and the ball starts jumping out like this, it's clear that the pitchers need to start making better pitches. Yeah, just great approach. No one really chased today. Really stayed staunch on, uh, on their ability to get that pitcher to come into the heart of the plate, and they did damage with it. Playing two, two, two. And a wave and a miss on a ball that was way out of the strike zone. There are two away now. Kyle Tucker will get the call to pinch hit here as we'll see what he can do with two out and the base is empty. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. But this one will bend foul. Had plenty of distance though as it landed in the upper deck. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. And he struck him out. So a fine inning here as he strikes out this side in order. Ryan Presley goes on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 55. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And that'll give way to the veteran second baseman, Howie Kendrick. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Now the 2 1 pitch. It's a swing and a miss at a slider breaking away. Full count now three and two. Juan Soto waits on deck. Kendrick waiting. Now the pitch. The bouncer to the left side. Bregman fields it cleanly. Throw to first is in time for the first down. 
So now down it'll be back. the four hole hitter, Juan Soto. He's batting cleanup, but has been shut down so far at the plate, 0 for 3. Now the one and one pitch. One out, nobody on. On, he pops it up. In there, a base hit. He'll get it into second. And he's able to hustle his way up to second as he'll reach here with a two base hit. The bat, the right field. At the plate, Eric Thames. Thames behind one and two. Presley is one of those guys that just seems to be at his best under pressure. Runners in scoring position, tight game, tough hitters at the plate. That's when he's at his best. One of the keys, Matty V, to being a good reliever is being able to pitch out of trouble. Trouble that's created by the pitchers before you, or sometimes you even have some mess that you put on yourself. Hey, regardless if it's a mess that he's inherited or one that he's created for himself, this guy makes good pitches when the game's on the line. Ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Here now the 2 2. Now on three and two as a pitcher, you've got to go with the pitch that you feel most comfortable throwing with. Ready now with the payoff pitch. High in the air down the right field line. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. He'll try it again, three and two. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Back goes Springer. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Here's Michael Brantley, singled home a run in his last time up. A swing, and this ball is blasted to right field. Nothing's going to keep this one in the ballpark. And gone up into the second deck. Must have been a good batting practice session today for this club. Five home runs in one game. You could just see it as the game was going on. Those hitters, they couldn't wait to get to the bat rack. It was like a fight to get up there and to get into the batter's box. Late now, Alex Bregman. Oh, they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Now batting. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. He's had a great game so far, and a triple would complete the cycle. The 3 1. Bases are empty, one man out. Fouled away. Another full count pitch home is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Stepping up to the plate, Jordan Alvarez. Three for four so far and seeing it well in this ball game. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. And there's strike three. So we'll see now if they can manage to hold on to this huge lead as the side is retired. Your Victor Robles please. will get up off the bench to lead off the home half of the night. Number and they've 15. certainly got their work cut out Victor. for them here. So he'll just need to work on getting aboard. Ground ball left side. Beautiful diving stop. Hey now. 
Stepping into the box, Ryan Zimmerman. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Zimmerman. Cold strike in a dangerous location there, one and two. Now, barring any late turnaround, this win would belong to Justin Verlander. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Again, a one two. Again, he sends it out of play. Now, another one two. Misses ball two. I don't blame the pitcher one bit for trying to get the chase right there. He's been fouling everything off. He's still got the entire arsenal open to him. So we'll see what pitch he comes with next. Brantley is under it. Two gone. Now batting, Wilmer Defoe. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. set and the 1-1 one, one pitch no offer on that one two balls and a strike and this ball swung on and hit to center field and this should do it he's got it and the Astros have come back to even up this series at a game apiece as this ball game is over well this game had its moments but it got out of hand pretty quick Always nice when you can coast to a six-run win. Save your closer for another day and let everyone in on the action. 11-5, to five, the final tally in this one. Houston wrote an important sixth inning to victory in this one. Justin Verlander earned his ninth win of the year. So that's a wrap for us in this one. Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, Matt Vaskersian, we all thank you for watching Major League Baseball on MLB Network. See you next time. Fans are final line score this afternoon. First for the victorious Astros, 11 runs on an even 20 hits. No errors, they left 11 men on base. For the Nationals, 5 runs, 7 hits, 1 error, they left 6 men on base.